basketball. But does it make help make the team like see what they have to go through? Like need a you know good get out to such a big lead in case no. teams make runs. We play games throughout this uh, so far. Um, you know, six of them ball games or so almost seventy now. Um, we've been up big. We've been down big. We've been in one point games. We've lost at buzzer. So it's just uh, basketball, and uh, we've been playing pretty good. Jason, does this feel a little bit like cruise control? Are you guys just sort of doing playing the game, doing what you have to do to win? But does it feel like the intensity doesn't go that high or go or, or that low? Uh, there's no cruise control here. You know, everybody's a professional. You got to play every game. Um, and try to get better, and that's what we've been doing. Jason, I know you guys take it game by game, so you're probably just looking at Boston on Sunday, but you guys have Boston coming up, and then you got Miami and OKC around the bend. How do you how do you view that schedule you have coming up? Well, I think you've answered the question. We only take one game at a time. Right? <laughs> so you, you asked the answer. <laughs> so we can only think about Boston right now. Jason, uh, what do you see in the JR, particularly in the He's the ball well. He's putting. I mean, uh, he loves golf, so we talk golf all the time. So he, oh yeah, I got. Um, he he he's putting the ball well. That I means he's he's hitting he's putting those ten footers quite well. And, you know, he's playing inside and out. You know, if you look at his game there in the last three, he hasn't taken a bad shot. So he hasn't hit a bad drive. Um, has the free throw tonight that she was upset about, but that just shows the growth that he's had in this run for us that, you know, he he's playing as well as anybody right now. Is there any way to gauge, because I know with him, uh, have coach Pat Vincent was always uh, is there any way to gauge whether that's sustainable for him or, you know, just uh, had a lot of with him? When he can drive the ball 330, and, you know, that's and it goes way right away left. He has the ability to, uh, you know, now hit it through 315 down the middle. It's, it's, it's easy. And, uh, you know, the game is coming to him easy, and I think his shot, he's looking at a shot chart. Um, a lot of them have been at the basket in the paint. And, uh, again, you know, you can ask him, free throws count too. And uh, I think that's the biggest part of this game right now is that he gets to the free throw line. What kind of confidence does the team have when you see JR take the court? Uh, well, we've always had confidence with Swiss, you know, taking the court. I think that the, the thing that we're all experiencing right now is just the growth of his game. And, uh, you know, it's been a while since somebody off the bench has scored 30 points or more um, or three times in a row. And that just shows uh, that it, he's, he's clicked and he's in his zone right now. Is this a good time for this team to get Boston and Miami back to back here? With the next two games. I mean, um, well, we're just saying about Boston. We just played them, so uh, we know that you know they want to try to get a payback game. So we got to protect home, um, and that's as far as we're thinking right now. It's just the Celtics going on Houston. How critical has the defense been over the seven-game winning streak? I think uh, it's back to where it was at the beginning of the season. I think our defense and us moving the ball um, has kind of stayed up for us of when we started in November. Do you prefer playing less minutes? Do you think 2025 is better for you than more than that? Anytime we're up 30, I don't have to play. So, I mean, I'd rather sit and watch my guys play because, um, you know, I don't need to be out there at that point. Just as an NBA observer, to see Miami's streak of 27 games go down, were, were you thinking that it was just not going to get to the 30? I mean, um, unfortunately, I just missed the Lakers streak uh, watching that. <laughs> so uh, I was, I'm happy to be that I can say I saw a streak. 20-something games, and Miami was playing extremely well, and uh, as a fan, it was fun to watch. Uh, I'm just glad it's over, because I know how big it would have been if we were going in there and both teams were on the street. Thank you, Jason. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, I'm coming.